friends, how you doing today? I am doing well. And and, and I got I got stuff. I got stuff in, I got stuff in the mail. I got wait a minute. Hold on. I got let me flip this over. There we go. Let's try this again. I got I got I got some stuff. I got some stuff in the mail. I don't know what it is. Not a clue. Not a clue of what I ordered and what this is. This might be a pile of garbage, or this might be uh, hidden treasures. Now, num number one, I, first first of all, let's, gonna, let's get this out of the way, because I have a strange feeling I know exactly what this is, because if you've been watching my channel, yes, it is. Um, I have been uh, collecting uh, one-six scale action figures. That's my new thing, but, but not just regular action figures. These, these are movie memorabilia action figures. We're talking the Terminator, uh, uh, guy from the, um, uh, wow, the guy from Lost Boys, uh, the Crow, you know, uh, stuff like that, you know, uh, uh, the Joker stuff. And if you are collecting um, one six scale action figures, you you need stuff for them. You need you need certain things because it's it's not just it's a hobby, but it's also a uh, chore. And first thing you need to get yourself is some good, uh, yeah, uh, stands for your figures. And you know, back in the day. The only stands I ever knew of were the ones that went around the waist. Those those old plastic, old school ones. But now these things, they call them, uh, I forgot what they call it. You, these, are, these are called U stands. But uh, other people call them crotch grabbers. And what I grab, what I, what I, what I, I grab my crotch. I, gra I grab three of my crotch grabbers. I grab my crotch three times. And uh, for three of my figures. Because I, I got some Clint Eastwood figures. I got some Clint Eastwood figures that did not come with stands. Because I got them from third party sellers. And they needed some stands. And that's 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 what I got there. So there's some stands there. Um, should I go for the... Should, am I messing up? Should I go for the... I'm going to go for the media. Go for the media. And then this, this box is light. This box is light, so I'm a little nervous. And it's made out to to me. And usually everything's made out to my wife. Let's, so let's, let's check this out first. This one's made out to me too. So I'm a little confused here. Um, I'm going to cut myself here. Uh, let's see. We have a copy of... Copy of... Oh, that was fast. Um, Spider-Man No Way Home. Yes, yeah, Sp Spider-Man... No Way Home and Blu-ray, DVD, and digital. Is there a digital code inside? Da da da. Let me open this up because I don't remember. Because I bought this thing off of Macari because I did not want to pay twenty twenty three twenty four dollars. I think it was at my local Walmart slash Target or whatever. So I was like, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go to Cheap Brew and I'm gonna go for Macari and then some guy was selling these things and had slipcase. So I was like, slipcase sold, um, Blu-ray, DVD. I, I didn't, I could I couldn't pull a trigger. I couldn't pull a trigger on the 4K because I, I have all of these on Blu-ray. I don't have all the Spider-Mans on 4K. I have all the Batmans on 4K, but not all Spider-Man. Wonder why? Because I don't, I'm not a 4K guy. I'm a Blu-ray guy. You know, I, I I buy the 4Ks only if I'm like a super fan. And was I a super fan of this movie? I gotta say, out of all of the Spider-Man movies with the uh, the Holland guy there, with, say his name on the cover there, because I always get his name wrong. Is it Tom Holland? Am I saying that right? Let me see. Da, 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 da. And I can't see. Uh, it's Tom Holland, right? It's Tom Holland. I'm I'm probably right without that. Yeah, my my daughter's probably yelling in the other room. Yeah, idiot. It's Tom Holland. Yeah, this this guy. This the the new the, this guy. The, this guy, the, the new Spider-Man. I'm not a big fan. Not a big fan. I'm a Tobey Maguire fan. I, I am a... Uh, who's the other guy? Oh, I, oh, I want to mess up his name. And that's T Garfield. Andrew Garfield. I'm, I'm, I, I, I loved me some Amazing Spider-Man. I love me some first original three Spider-Man movies. And, but this guy... No, the, the problem was... Is he had no backstory he, he, because he joined the Avengers and he was in an Avengers film before he he had his whole Spider-Man and then his Spider-Man show it, we didn't get the the death of, of uh, um we didn't get the death of Uncle Ben we didn't get the 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 communication and in, in, in the 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 memorable events between uh Aunt Aunt uh wow Aunt Aunt Veru no where would I get Aunt Veru from Aunt, uh Aunt, Auntie Auntie M Auntie wow, wow Auntie <laughs> Aunt uh, Auntie, uh, Aunt, Uncle Ben and Aunt May. Aunt May, yes. <laughs> wow, that was terrible. Aunt Veru. Is Aunt Veru from, uh, I think, I want to say that's Superman. And Auntie M is definitely from Wizard of Oz. I don't know where I'm going with that. But um, I just, 
I think it's because this kid didn't have a backstory. I didn't get to see him develop into Spider-Man. He just all of a sudden became Spider-Man. And I had a hard time with that. And then they, they, he came out with the next movie and the other movie. And I'm just, this might be just me. But don't all the titles of these movies sound exactly the same? Home? Isn't it like, what do we got? No Way Home. And I'm trying to look for, for my Spider-Man movie. Because they're so buried because I don't even watch... I won't watch these spi- Wait, wait. Okay. Uh, oh, sorry. They're right here. Okay. Okay. Far From Home. No Way Home. Uh, homecoming. A lot of home stuff going on over here. This guy, this is like, got a problem with his home. Maybe he should just stay at home. I, I, don't, I don't know what the problem is. But everything's got a home in its cover. And a uh, title. And, and it's, it's not like... I, I prefer Spider-Man 1, uh, Spider-Man 2, and Spider-Man 3. How about this? Uh, the Amazing Spider-Man. How about... And the Amazing Spider-Man Two, but no, we got Far From Home, Homecoming, Driving Home, Driving Miss Daisy Home. I, 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 listen, Spider-Man, just just stay home, stay home, and you won't have no problems. You won't have no problems. This if this Spider-Man just stays home, we don't have to call his, his Spider-Man movies some kind of time. But this one, I got I got to throw this out there was good. Why was it good? Spoiler, if you, listen, if you never seen this, so sorry. But well, this is going to be a spoiler. It's got Andrew Garfield in it, and it's got Tobey Maguire, and that's why I was on board. I, I ran. I didn't I didn't sprint, and I'm, I'm a big guy. I wasn't sprinting to the movie theater for this thing. I was running to the movie theater for this thing. I ran because I was like, got me, what, what, I hear, I hear it through the, the YouTube grapevine. I hear it through the, the TikTok grapevine that there's going to be some Tobey Maguire. There's going to be some Andrew Garfield, and all, all of the old villains were going to be in this, the good villains, the awesome villains, the ones that I love, what, what, what? Yeah, they're, they're in this. I am there. And I and I watched this at the movie theater. And, and oh, oh, I dropped the slipcover. That's it. Stay in there. Stay in where it is. Loved it. Absolutely loved it. I got to say, out of all of the um, Tom Holland uh, Spider-Man collection, this one is hands down the best. Was it because of him? I don't think so. I think it was because the anticipation of seeing the other Spider-Men and all of the old villains that i came to love throughout the whole franchises of the original three and the two and listen to me i i was i was so when i didn't when when i heard that there wasn't going to be another amazing spider-man with andrew garfield i was i was like why why and then at the end of this movie they, they, they play three. That's the magic number. The song by de la soul okay if you if you're not a big uh 90s uh rap fan i i was in the 90s and i was listening to rap okay and there was a song by de la soul and it was like they used like a clip from i want to say it was like from a sesame street song it was from something whatever or an old like disco song but it was like three that's the magic number and the three that's the, at the end of this thing they play three is the magic number and in my head this is what this is what i thought and i and, and listen quote me on it don't quote me on it i don't know i'm not sure but this Spider-Man guy, he got three movies, okay? Just hear me out. The, the first, Tobey Maguire, he got three Spider-Man movies. Andrew Garfield had some kind of issue with the director or writer. Or something, something happened there. He only got two. But if you listen to the end of this movie, three, that's the magic number. So Andrew Garfield needs to go back and do a third Amazing Spider-Man. It's got to be a third Amazing Spider-Man. It's got to be. It's three, three, three. It's got to be. It's got to. It's a thing. Okay, it's it. To, this guy Tom Holland, he he can stay home. Okay, the Avengers are all dead. They, they they dismantled. Okay, they fell apart. Okay, we Iron Man, he's he done goofed. Okay, he's not around no more. Uh, you know, wait a minute. God, 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 God be with him. But he he didn't make it. And listen, it's time for a new Amazing Spider Man with Andrew Garfield. I, 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 Tom Holland, I'll miss you. Rest in peace, my friend. But. Andrew Garfield needs another movie. Okay, that, that, that's what happens. So take a little break. Take a little hiatus. Hey, guess what? Hey, 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 Tom Holland, stay home. Stay home and let Andrew Garfield make the third movie that he should have made. Um, and in here, I had oh, a digital code. And for the first person that gets this, you can have my digital code. Why? Because I don't stream things. I buy physical media. Look, I got the Blu-ray and the DVD. Why did I want the Blu-ray and the DVD? Because I own all Spider-Mans on DVD. I own all Spider-Mans on Blu-ray. So I need to have Spider-Man on Blu-ray and Spider-Man on DVD. And then the other thing was, is I was afraid that eventually one time my Blu-ray player might break. What if my Blu-ray player breaks? Well, I, I got Blu-ray. I got rooms in this house that just have a DVD player. What if, what if I want to watch this DVD? I needed the DVD. Now, do I need the 4K? Possibly. Possibly there'll be a box set, and I will buy the Spider-Man box set. I, I listen. I buy so it's, my my Spider-Man collection is is odd. Okay, I know you're waiting for the for the um for the me to give the 
the uh, digital, but I'm not I'm not doing that just yet because right on the side of me here, let me get my John Wicks out of the way and my my um I gotta make a little room here. Um, I'm a little Spider Man crazy here. See, because we got the first three, the original three, Spider Man one, two, and three, in this little nifty little box set here. Okay, and then uh, we have our Amazing Spider Man and Amazing Spider Man two. See, see how simple that is. The Amazing Spider Man and Amazing Spider Man two. Yes, that's what we got there. But then uh, they came out with these things in these little cases here, which have the special limited edition. Because this one, this one has the three Spider Mans once again: Spider Man one, two, and three, Tobey Maguire, and it has um. Wait a minute, because the reason why I picked this thing up and the the probably uh, if you didn't know or you do know, this one has Spider Man one, Spider Man two. And Spider Man Three. Wait a minute. What's what's the what was the deal here? Why did I? There was a reason behind this. Um, da, 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 da. three movie collection special. Uh, Spider Man Three edited cut. Uh, was on here, and I think that was like the first time that that was was introduced on here. But then you know, then you know, you, you got you got to get you got to get the respect to the Andrew Garfield, and you got to get the 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 two set of his movies on this special little uh, digi pack type thing too so yeah uh, i'm a little bit of a spider-man fan from the old school guys and then i got these nifty little things that came up we got the oh look it's a far from home far from home i saw far from home and this one over here look homecoming okay and, and i always get these confused I, I always get confused is this part one is this part two or is this part one or is this part two well, if you would have called it Spider-Man 1 and 2, uh, Spider-Man, how about Spider-Man Home 1, Spider-Man Home 2, and then, oh, what, look, look, what's here? Spider-Man Home 3, and now I dropped the digital code, and I gotta go diving for it, I gotta go diving, and, uh, but I, I'm still, I'm, I'm going, it's down there, it's down there, I'll, I'll grab the, I'll grab the, uh, I got this, this box too, um, I'll grab, hope there was nothing breakable in that thing, hang on, and I'm back, okay, whew, that was, that was a rough one, one because because as I as I stood up, the razor knife fell down, hit me in the foot, bounced underneath the, uh, my table over here, and I could not find the thing because I dropped my my digital and my my what a mess. All right, anyway, um, yeah. So so as I was saying, um, then, then you had this thing, you had the, you had this thing which I haven't even opened yet, haven't even watched it yet. I got to get on board with this thing eventually, Spider Man into the Spider Verse, but it's a cartoon, and I was like. Do I care? I don't know. I, I, I gotta get it because it's Spider-Man, but I, I, do I care? Not really. Um, and, uh, 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 where, where am I? Where am I oh, oh, digital code. How about this one? Uh, first person that gets it. This is the way it works. First person that gets it. Please do me a favor and just put down downstairs, put down, put downstairs in the comments. I got it. Thank or thank you. I got the code. Or yes, I have the code. Or I appreciate the code. Or... Thumbs up, I got the code. So, hey, something, okay? Because what ha what's going on here is that I got other people that watch this thing, which I appreciate. Appreciate every single one of you. Appreciate you watching it. But what's happening is that after after the code is taken, um, people keep trying to get the code, you know? And, and this is a one-shot deal. Once you see it, you're, you're the winner of the code. You get the code. You take the code. You download the code. Nobody else can use the code. So forever this video is in, in, is in limbo and people are like, if, they, if nobody puts a thank you or, or I got the code or I appreciate the code or thumbs up with the code, they don't put something saying that they got the code or I don't personally go, hey, code's no good anymore because I, I don't know. Because I don't even know how, to, how these codes work. I wonder why? Because I don't care. I don't. This is your thing, okay? The people on eBay are selling these things for like 10 bucks a pop. I don't need... I, I could probably be doing that too, but I'm I'm not that guy. I'm not that that guy that strips apart the things. That, hey, look. Oh, look. Uh, is $5 for the... Uh, the cover here, oh, slip cover, five dollars. Uh, you you can buy this on on uh, eBay for five dollars. Um, buy it now or uh, send me the best offer. Oh look, I'm gonna send you. So, uh, I'll sell you. Wait, wait, hold on, hey, wait for it. The DVD. Eight dollars for the DVD. Oh, wait a minute. Let me sell you. Wait a minute. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. The Blu-ray, uh, ten dollars for the Blu-ray. Oh, hold on a second. Wait, we're not done yet. We're, we're not done yet because what? You need a cover? Oh, cover, just cover only. Best offer, um, seven bucks maybe. Hmm. And digital code, hmm, ten dollars. I'm not that guy. Okay, but yeah, listen, I I bought this thing. Off a of guy I'm a Kari, and I paid. Okay, I'll make sure I give you the right price. Uh, the price here, the right price. I'm a Kari because it was complete, and it said it came with the digital code, and I did pay the guy. I think it was sixteen dollars. By the time these flipping fools get done with this thing and rip this thing apart, they made so much of a profit, 
I, I don't know how they sleep at night. That's what I got to say. I don't know how these people sleep at night because if you pay $15, $16 for this thing, then and you want to sell it, then you should sell it for $15, $16. And as far as the digital codes, if you have no use for it, then just give it to somebody. You know, what are you going to... I was talking to the wife the other day, and it, it get, it, listen, you, you can bash me on this one if you want. I'm thinking that heaven... Okay, I'm, I'm going to go biblical on you here. Heaven looks like an old abandoned mall right now. That's that's what I think. I would say hell would be pretty much full. And it's probably full of a lot of uh, flippers and, and sh shysters and swinglers and, and, and uh, uh, humdingers and uh, uh, schnoz wankers and rotten vermicious canids. Listen, it's filled with a lot of scumbag people. Scum these scumbag scumbagish flipping people. Okay, that's what, that's what hell is all filled up with. And then you look at heaven. And you know what heaven is? It's kind of it probably looks like an old abandoned mall. That's there's probably like four or five old people walking around, smiling, not worrying about a thing. But hell, it's it's crowded. Hell's crowded because it's full of these flippers. These flipping these flipping guys. You know where they're going? These flipping guys are going to hell. That's what that's where they're going. We eat the pig and then together we burn. Because how can you sleep by tearing something apart to this fraction? It, 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 this is ridiculous. This is not worth anything without all of this, okay? To me, that's the way it works. You know, I have no use for, for this and this and this and this. I want it all. I want it all together. That's, why, would I, why would I buy this and then sell it in piece by piece? I, I don't get it. I, I don't get it. Maybe it's just my, not my heart, not my head. But I have a problem with it. And on top of that... I just give these things away. There you go. First person that gets it, I'm going to hold it still so you can probably get it. I mean, just make sure I'm getting close enough there. I'm going to do the little splice thing so you don't see my head or my face or whatever so you can get this thing properly. And the first person that gets it, enjoy. Enjoy your Spider-Man. Let me make sure I, I got to look at the name again because, wonder why? Because they made it difficult for me. Enjoy your Spider-Man No Way Home. Enjoy it on the weekend with your family. Enjoy it with your kids. Enjoy it with wh whoever you... Wh if, if this is a date night for you, download, download the thing and watch it on your TV and enjoy it. Because you know what? I have no use for it. I have the Blu-ray. I have the DVD. I don't need it. I don't need it. I'm never going to need... I'm not going to watch this thing on my phone. You know, listen, I'm a movie guy. I need a TV. Okay, I need a TV. I need a. I need a uh, projector. I need a, a screen. I need. I need. I'm not watching this stuff on my phone. And yeah, I know this stuff can be downloaded onto your TV, and you can watch it on your TV. I got the disc. I, I don't need the, the, the. I don't need the buffer thing. I don't need that buffering thing going on in my life. If that's your thing, you're welcome. You're welcome to it. Take it. Love it. Enjoy it. Hit a subscribe button for me. If you if, listen, if you're not subscribed, if, if you're part of the forty percent that hasn't subscribed to this channel yet, hit the subscribe button and help a guy out because I do this all the time. I give these things away because that's what I do. I I, I want to see you happy. That's what that's what I'm looking. I'm looking to see you happy. If I can bring a little laughter, a little joy into someone's life, then that's what I want to do. And uh, with that said, I still I still got a box. I still got a box that, that I didn't want to forget. And this is light. So here's my theory on this. I don't remember. What this is, it is made out to me. Normally, everything that I order is made out to the wife. Why? So that she can't fault me for that. I don't want her to be like, you look at all the stuff that you bought. I'm like, no, 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 no. Look at all the stuff you bought. Okay, everything's in your name. Everything says your name on it. Look at all the stuff you bought. Not me, not me. You you did it. But this one, uh, un unfortunately, or fortunately, is in my name. And that's usually mind-blowing to me because I can't remember what I bought. Now, hopefully, this isn't something weird. Um, I might, I might okay, make sure I'm not a... Uh, All right. This is something a little different. I'm gonna pause for a second, and uh, I, I am gonna, I'm gonna. This video is gonna go on for a few more seconds, and you can, you can stay on with me, or you can, you can make a run for it. Um, I'm gonna tell a story, quick story. Um, I'm a teacher. I teach. Um, I teach preschool. I, I'm, I'm a preschool teacher. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a, I'm a man, <laughs> preschool teacher. This is the first time I'm, I'm acknowledging this to my, my, my people, to my, my, my friends here. And that's why I address you as my friends, because I spend my whole day saying, hello, my friend, or hi, my friend, or, or what do you need, my friend? How can I help you, my friend? That, that's, that's how I, that's how I acknowledge these kids all day long. Well, you know, they, they need their, their drink pouch open. Sure, my friend. Uh, you know, 
can I can I help you with that, my friend? That, that that's how I acknowledge people. So that's why that's why I start every single one of my shows with "Hello, my friend, how are you?" Um, so uh, I'm not giving any names away, so I I can do this, and I'm not giving any pictures away, so I can do this. Uh, last week, this came really fast. This came really fast, and this was a little confusing because I was trying to figure out what this was. Last week, um, I had a little girl in my class. Uh, she was running around outside, and she slipped and fell, and she cut her arm up. Pretty, pretty bad. It's pretty, pretty good cut on her elbow, bleeding, and um, all, all of a sudden I, I, I get a yell. They, whenever there's, whenever there's blood, the other teachers yell for me. I, I'm, I'm that guy. I'm the guy. I handle the blood. I, I put on the rubber gloves. I, I get the, I get the disinfectant, and I, and I take care of the problem because you know what? They, they, they're my responsibility. When you know you drop your kids off with me. I take care of your kids from this time and your and I I gonna, I'm gonna return them the way that they came in you know if not better you know that that that's my goal but sometimes accidents happen sometimes people fall and the kids fall sometimes I fall and, and they need to be cleaned up so um, this little girl uh, she she's she's looking at the blood and she looks like she's gonna pass out obviously can't handle blood very well so the teacher calls over to me. And uh, just so happens that the teacher is my, my daughter. She she works with me. And as a matter of fact, most of my family works with me. That's why I go a little crazy because I can't really escape from my family because they're, they're with me. But um, she calls for me and she's like, uh, she looks like she's going to pass out. And I'm like, okay, listen, calm down. I got this. I am a pro. I am in charge here. And you're going to come with me and we're going to take care of this. So she, right away, she's like, She's on board, okay? And we go inside, and I pick her up, and I put her on the table, and I put on my rubber glove, and I, I grab my my band aid, and I grab my my soap and uh, water on uh soap and water on on the paper towel, and I clean off the arm, and and and, and I, I and I look at her, and um and I clean her off. I'm like, it's some cold water. I'm gonna clean it off for you. You're gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be fine. She's shaking. She's shaking. She's nervous. She's nervous. She's nervous. She's nervous. So um, I clean her up. And, uh, okay, <laughs> I clean her up and I, um, she, she wants to go to her backpack because she has her pillow in her backpack and her, um, her pillow was given to her by her mother. And I don't know the story behind the mother. I don't know where the mother is. I don't know the story. I'm not gonna. T I can't tell you the story because I don't know what the story is. But this pillow is her go-to when she's scared. Her go-to when she's 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 crying when she's nervous. And this pillow has been through a war. Okay, this if you've seen this thing, it's been through a war. And, and she she. I knew what she was going for, so I, I run right over and I help her get her pillow out of her backpack, and um, we sit at the table, and she, I have to fill out a report of, of an accident. You no, know, she had an accident, so I got to fill out a report so her her family could sign it. And um, I'm filling out the report, and I'm like, oh, uh, you know, where where is it? Okay, oh, oh, oh left arm. Oh, uh, where? And, and you know, and. and she she's like, can I can I make a puzzle? Because we got puzzles. I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. You make a puzzle. I'm gonna ask you some questions while I'm making a puzzle. Get her mind off of what's going on. Because everything was it was it was so intense. She was so so worked up and, and shaky and scared. And um, so she's making the puzzle. And we're talking and 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 she lets go of the pillow and she puts the pillow on the table. And I'm, listen, I'm a man. I'm a man. I'm a man that got straight A's and sewing. Okay, I'm a man that that in school. I took sewing. I took I took sewing classes, okay, and, and I learned how to sew. I can whip stitch, okay. You, you sewers out there, I can, I'm, a, I'm, a sti I'm a sewing stitching guy, and her pillow was all ripped up and and all uh, messed up. And I'm like, if I take your pillow and I and I fix it for you, I said, would, would that make you happy? And she refers to this thing as pillow. She's like, oh, I think pillow would like that. You know, pillows old, you know, and 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 messed up. And I, I'm like. I'm like, if you don't mind me asking, where did you get pillow from? And she goes, pillow used to belong to my mommy. And um, it's uh, really important to me because my mommy gave it to me. Now, 
I don't know where her mommy is. And I got to tell you, it really affected me that this this pillow is to me like i said i'm not i'm not giving anything away and not but this pillow has become her sign of comfort from her mom so i look at the pillow and i got this google app thing on my phone and i'm like maybe i can find her another pillow maybe i can f now listen let's let's make this clear i know that whatever this pillow is is not gonna replace her mom it's not going to replace the pillow that her mom gave her. But maybe I can give her something to bring a little bit of joy in her life. Maybe I can give her something to bring a little joy into her family's life. Because I'm going to when I, when I show you what's in this box, you can, you, you're going to understand a little bit more. Um, so I, 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 I Google the, the, the picture. You know, I, 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 I take a picture of it and it goes on a search thing. Nothing. Can't find this thing anywhere. It, it doesn't exist. I, I was like, maybe maybe your mom made it for her. Maybe it was something that was made for the mom by the mom. You know, maybe her grandmother made this for the mother and it got passed on to the to the to the granddaughter or to the daughter. I couldn't find it anywhere. And then I finally found it. And um I'm not gonna I'm not gonna unwrap it for you because I'm I, I, I'm gonna kinda try to give it to her like this so she can unwrap it herself because they wrapped it for me. They did a good job. And what's in here is um her pillow. It this is this is the same pillow that she had. And the thing about this pillow is it it's from the eighties. It's from the mid eighties and they don't make them anymore. It's it's a throw pillow for a eighties couch. And as odd as that could be, um you know I gotta I gotta Did they put my name on this thing? Thank you. Oh no! It says it just says thank you for your purchase. I'm gonna I'm just gonna keep it like this. I'm gonna take the thank you for the purchase out there. They gave a little is that a yeah? It's a little little file. That's what the, that is. It's like a, a little nail file thing there. Oh, just fell off. It's okay. I'll put it back on there. Let me let me uh, get this out of the way. I'll put it back in the box a little bit. But um, so to finish this off, so I found it and I told her I said I I showed her the picture and she, her face lit up and she goes. It's pillow and it's new and and beautiful and I haven't seen pillow like that ever and I looked at her and I was like so let's say that I I was to get you this pillow now I I, I wouldn't want you to ever lose your other pillow but what's let's, let's say I gave this to you as a gift because you're my friend what would you do with it she goes oh she goes I keep it at home she goes I bring this pillow with me to school because it's old and ripped and torn up and I keep this beautiful pillow at home so I could take care of it so it could stay clean and beautiful and before she could even finish the sentence the pillow was sold okay and I'm gonna tell you right now it's one of these things where I didn't care what the price was they could have told me this pillow was $100. I would have paid $100. They could have told me this pillow was $200. I would have paid $200. To bring a little bit of joy into this little girl's life meant a lot to me. Now, to top it all off, I didn't want to offend the mother. The, well, the, I didn't want to offend the grandmother. I didn't want to offend the grandmother by giving this pillow to her her granddaughter. I don't. I don't. I don't know what the private situation is. I didn't want to offend nobody, so I asked permission. I, I I waited the next day and I said, "Listen, I want to give this as a gift to your your granddaughter. I don't know what your personal situation is. I don't know where mom is. I don't know what's going on. I don't know anything. Um, is it okay if I give this to her as a gift?" And she started started crying. She started crying, which in turn made me cry. And I, I told her, I said, listen, I'm not looking for anything. I'm not looking for anything. Um, your granddaughter is a good kid. She's a sweet kid. She deserves something really, really nice. Something she deserves to be happy. And I'm hoping that this will make her happy now. And I, and I told, told her just like this. I said, this will never take the place of her mom or the mom's pillow. This is a gift from her teacher. 
and hopefully later on in her life when she's teenager, you know, getting married or whatever the situation is, she might think back of her pre-K teacher and be like, yeah, that guy, you know that guy? <laughs> that guy cared about me enough to do something like that for me. And um, that's, what, that's what this is. <sighs> and with that said, my friends, please do me a favor. Please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. And I will see you later.